Hi, I'm Brian from iWire, and today I'm gonna to show you how to depin ECU connectors. We sell the tools on our website. The standard green set, there's a five of them in that set. That, this is a standard tool from that set. This one is a specific depinning tool for the drive-by wire ECUs. So the first step for any uh, depinning of an ECU is there's a small lock tab on the bottom. And you can see there's little edges to grab it. I think I need that slightly more. Ow. They're a little sticky, but you can see here, it only comes out maybe a couple of millimeters. It's not gonna come all the way out, it's just to loosen it. Once you've done that, then we can depin it. So I'll show you how to do that. So we lift up the tab, I'm going to depin this lower left corner. Now with the flat side, there's going to be a release tab. And you're going to kind of push it in there and lift up. And it'll slide right out the back. And then we can put it back in, push the lock tab, and we're good to go. So same thing applies here, there's a little lift tab, it's going to come just out a little bit. Let's see, just barely. And then for the upper rows, it's the exact same as we did for the other one. Push the terminal release tool in, lift the tab, slide it out the back. The lower rows are actually really easy if you have the correct tool, remember we sell this one. See how it's got a flat side and an edge? It's probably hard to see on the camera, but it does. There's an upper circle and a lower flat spot. The lower flat spot, you're just gonna push it in. It's gonna release the mechanism this way and slide out the back. So we'll show you how to do that. Same thing, lift the tab, got a nice Released here, we're gonna lift, we're gonna release the bottom left one again. So I'm looking at the flat one, not the circle one. The circle one was where the terminal is. Don't put anything in there. Push the tool in, you can almost see it. I'm not sure the camera will pick it up. And then it just slides out the back because the detents are pushed out. And then when you're done, put it back in, lock it, push it down and you're done. And that's it. Pretty simple if you have the right tools.